Welcome back to Stone Hill on this snowy, gorgeous, sunny day. You know, usually on this channel, we're just filming what we do outside. We have so much fun um, doing our wood hauling and building and um, hiking and all that kind of fun stuff. But today we decided we'd take you inside for a full blown cabin tour of every room in the house um, from the very tippy top loft all the way down to the basement. So just thought some of you might be curious about the cabin and the layout. You know, from a distance, the cabin looks really little, but once you get inside, you'll see it has lots of room, uh, lots of room for us to all spread out, and it's really cozy. So I'm excited to show you guys all the details inside. So come on in, come with me. All right, so when you first come in the main door here, you're right in the kitchen. All the walls are log, of course. Beautiful wood vaulted ceiling. And when you walk in, it kind of smells like a cedar closet or like you're walking into a sauna. Has everything you could need. We have full electricity, full plumbing. The cabin was built in the 80s, so we have everything we need. Electric stove, electric fridge, have everything we need. Nice view here when I'm cooking to see everybody out there sledding. I think they're working on a new sledding run. Spot for my colander. When I'm doing dishes here, I've got a nice view out this way too. So it's a really great, cozy, functional kitchen. We have our burn and no burn right there for garbage, shoes. Our entryway, we don't have a closet, but we hung a bunch of hooks here to maximize our space. Each of the kids have a hook, Joel and I have hooks. And then I put in these storage baskets, which were great for mittens, snow socks, and hats. And then we have extra storage in here too for more mittens, hats, snow stuff, lighter fluid, pool stuff for the summer. So the kitchen opens up here to the living room. It's all kind of an open concept. Living room. We have a little TV here in the corner. 
gorgeous Norwegian yodel stove, which we just love. Blanket storage. <laughs> and then if you look up, you can see the loft, the beautiful beams. All connected, but there's plenty of room. It's so spacious. We've got a puzzle we're starting here tonight. Look at that, good looking buck. Couple dough. School books, school books everywhere. Nice big beautiful door going outside. We'll move over here. This is kind of like our music room. And also the stairs to the loft. So this is where the kids and I practice our piano. Bookshelf there. Hello. <laughs> And then these fun stairs, we have more storage under here. So cute. And just look at the craftsmanship. Every nook and cranny of this cabin, you just see the, just the craftsmanship. You see the love that went into this cabin. Stairs are so beautifully done. We're gonna go up here to Luke's room. This is our 11 year old son's room. Here's the loft. He's got a nice big bed here, so when guests come, they can have their king size. And it kind of overlooks the whole dining, living room, kitchen area. Over here is the kitchen. Hello! Hi. We have a visitor. Say hi, YouTube. <laughs> There's a brave sledder. There's lots of great storage up here. A set of cubbies, another set, and they go way back in. I'm gonna take you in here. So you can see, this is where I keep like all my Christmas stuff. It goes way back in there. There's our Christmas tree, everything. These cubbies are huge. It's great storage. And then my son can keep his toys here and he keeps a bunch more in this cubby. All right, and that's the loft. It's really fun. He loves it up here. All the kids love it up here. Beautiful ceiling. All right, let's head on back down. I'll show you my room. Getting the full 10 cent tour. Look at this girl. I got a scratch yesterday. Yes, you did. How'd you get your scratch? Well, I was going sledding and then I technically came into these sharp weeds and then I got scratched. Yes, it's a, big one. a thorn. Mm -hmm. Oh, but it's looking so good. It's looking so good. Yeah, it's okay. It's looking so good. All right, oh, I wanna show you this too. This is so cool. Let's show YouTube this door. Yeah. Hello, it's like a shop. <laughs> just a great Dutch door, look at that, it's just so fun. The detail in this cabin is just fantastic. All right, let's go through here. We're gonna show my room now. Mm -hmm. That's room. Yeah, mom's room. Mm -hmm. Look at the nice woodwork too. On the interior walls, they're either drywall with really nice paneling on the bottom or full decorative wood, it's just so great. There's our really great Dutch door. It even has like a nice little ledge here. Just gorgeous. All right, let's check out mom's room. Mm -hmm. Mom and dad's room. I love this room. I love the logs. I love the ceiling. Just really homey and cozy. Two nice closets here for Joel and I. And then we added some lighting up behind some of the beams. You can't see it unless you really, really crane your head to look, but it adds a really nice glow. So if any of you have log cabins or beams like this, I highly recommend getting some of these running lights. They're really cheap. They're like maybe $12 a strand at Menards. We just tacked them right up and it adds such a nice glow. We have some behind the last beam up there too. You can't tell right now with the sunshine, but really great. Hey, bathroom, main floor bathroom. Check out these leaves on the floor. 
Look at that. Doors. We have leaf pull handles. Nice big storage unit. And for the mother. Nice big bathroom. Hello. Stand up shower. And a nice view over the valley. And daddy's home. I hear another visitor. Mm -hmm. And then this is the door into my bathroom. So it's like an ensuite. Very handy. Very, very handy. All right, then in the dining room here, we have this big, gorgeous door. And that takes us out to the screen porch. All right, let's go out. I just got back in my All right. Nice, big, screened-in porch. Off the dining room here. Nice view of the prairie. I can come check on my garden right here and a good view of the valley too over there all right now I'm going to take you down into the basement and that's the last part of the tour this is the place where we get all dressed up to get it to go yeah still hung up her things very nice mm -hmm. and downstairs we go down we go Look at those cuties, huh? Mm -hmm. Cutie cutes. Yeah, so we have another table down here where we do school. We have our map there. And another living room down here with a fireplace. Really cozy. Lots of room to spread out. There's a deer. There's a deer. Here we just have utility room. We have some storage, some sleeping oil. bags, dehydrator for venison, <laughs> all of our gear, canning jars, and then we have our school shelf here where we have all of our school books and curriculum. Um, so other than that, oh, let me show you. I'll show you the girls' room and the bathroom too. Wait, I want to show them. Oh, you want to show the girls' room? Okay, here's the girls' room. Yes. Which bed's yours? This one. All right. I love dogs. Yeah. And there's Sophie's bed. And again, we got really big beds for when guests come. So Luke has a king size, Stella has a queen, Sophie has a queen. And that's so when we have all of our friends or family come for Christmas, holidays, parties, the kids can all sleep together, you know, somewhere on the floor. And all the guests get all these big beds. And then here we have a nice big closet, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We made Oh, do you want to show the fort? You found a buddy, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. She's Teddy. Oh, so there's the girls' room. I love these felt garlands I found on Etsy. Just makes it a little bit sweet. I found these fun <laughs> stuffed taxidermy. And I got my woodsies. And woodsies, of course. Rambly Hedge. Rambly Hedge, highly recommend. Jokes. If you have any little people in your lives. And just some sweet prints of the creatures around here. All right, let's head into the bathroom. We have a bathroom down here too. All the lights are on, lots of good storage. Um, sink, toilet, and then a nice big and bathtub. Soap. Nice big bathtub and shower. Puppy soap. And some puppy soap, thank you. And All right, last but not least, what do we have over here? Okay, laundry room and mudroom. And then that's the whole tour. The whole 10 cent tour. The washroom. Wash and dry every day, right? Mm -hmm. Every day. The Laundry sink. This cabin really has absolutely everything. This is not roughing it in the least. We have a great um, water heater right there. Instantaneous flash water heater, which I love. Never, ever, ever run out of hot water. And then connected to here is the mudroom. And this is something that we're really excited to redo, to take on as a big project. Um, we wanna do a bunch of shelves and benches and hooks and get some tile down and the whole nine yards. And then out here, we have the garden again. Mm -hmm. That's right. And we're done with the tool. Look at all these wellies. We're collecting all the rain boots we can possibly find. That way when all the cousins come over and aunts and uncles and friends visit, um, we have rubber boots for everybody. It's 
either wet or muddy most of the year. All right, well that is the whole tour. Basement, loft, main floor. You can give them a tour of the stairs. The stairs. It's just a really special place. Oh, Mom, show them the we feel so blessed to have found Mom, this show place. Them the they do. They saw it. I, I zoomed in on it before. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this little tour. I'm sure a lot of you were kind of wondering what it was like inside here when you'd see our outdoor videos. And that's it. Some beautiful logs and everything you'd need out here in the wilderness. Wood. <laughs> Wood. All right. Have a great day, guys. We'll see you here next time.